you probably understand what is considered a living thing. A giraffe, centipede, and a tree are all living things. A desk, a water bottle, and stop signs aren't. But what really makes a living thing? Does it have to feel pain? Move around? Or just have DNA? The question is actually quite complicated, and a perfect definition just doesn't exist, because not all scientists agree. Some of the main things that are characteristics of living things are energy use, growth, reproduction, adapting and responding to the environment. I think that we can all agree that giraffes, centipedes, and trees fulfill all these requirements. But how about bacteria and viruses? Bacteria need energy to survive, they grow until they get large enough, and then asexually reproduce, creating a copy of itself. Bacteria also respond and adapt to the environment by adjusting enzymes, proteins, and other molecules to keep it as safe and efficient as possible. Many viruses are still undiscovered, and new viruses that shake the wall between living and non-living things are emerging. But most viruses do not use energy. They are built out of protein pieces, which means they do not grow. Most, if not all, need a host cell to replicate and cannot do it on their own. And also, viruses do not adapt to their environment, though they do experience natural selection. Now, I wouldn't really mind if someone said that a virus was a living thing, but in my opinion, viruses are non-living things. They're just a piece of DNA or RNA covered with a protein coat and possibly an envelope. So why do viruses even exist if they don't even have the want to live? It all comes down to natural selection. The DNA or RNA that endures and replicates moves on to replicate more and more. The viruses that are the most efficient multiply and basically take over the world. The only real reason that viruses exist is because DNA and RNA both experience natural selection. I hope now that you know enough about viruses and life to make an educated decision on whether you think viruses are alive or dead. Let me know in the comments and have a super duper delicious day.